Hi, my name's James Balm and I'm an archaeologist and historian who's been researching the village of Warburton in Cheshire for over 11 years. Based on the use of aerial photography, maps, field walking and indeed metal detecting, I went on to recover ancient evidence going back over two to four thousand years from the early Neolithic through to the Bronze Age and beyond to the Roman period. As a result of the amazing discoveries I was pulling out of the ground, the media got involved using local television, local radio and in 2006 I was joined here in Warburton by Channel 4's very own Time Team. There's loads of metalwork including coins, brooches and this gorgeous little snake bracelet. But the site itself remains an archaeological mystery. So what was going on here? Local archaeologists believe they've discovered a fortlet, but then not all the finds are military and they cover over 250 years of the Roman occupation. So what were the Romans doing here in Warburton? We've got just three days to find out. The use of aerial photography was crucial in discovering the ancient settlement of Warburton, leading back to the Roman times where many artefacts including coins and brooches were found. Indeed, silver Roman coinage predating to the Roman Republic were found in the village, all left behind by the Roman soldiers. So before my research began into the ancient origins of Warburton village, just what was known about its history and indeed its past. Behind me lies the ancient church of St Werberg where Warburton took its name. St Werberg was a Saxon saint, but the evidence recovered from Warburton that I have found predates this church by anything up to 5,000 years. It's widely believed that this doorway behind me once led to a hospital annex built by the Norbertine monks who created the church and indeed the abbey at Warburton. <laughs> During the past 11 years, my research into the village has revealed the history of what was going on here many thousands of years ago. But the story doesn't end there. Later this year, as the crops are removed, I'll be back into Warburton to find more vital evidence left behind by our ancient ancestors, including the Romans. Mm -hmm.